yes guys i'm enjoying this showing you guys around at least i love the last video i did you know showing you guys the view you know so i want to do another one today i hope you enjoy it i hope you love it so i'm going to be showing you my work area this is where i came to work today so i just wanted you guys to see how the environment looks i wanted you guys to see how the environment looks like it's a beautiful place i mean america is so huge and there are different places that sometimes when you go to you will be like wow this area i mean it's such a beautiful area and I just want you guys to see what it looks like. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, give me a thumbs up and share this video to your friends and loved ones. Stay tuned, guys. So, guys, look at this area. It's a, you know, it's a very beautiful place. It has boats. This is um, marine quarters. This place is the only, it's only for the marine people that can live in this kind of place yeah those who work in the marine guys america is very beautiful for real this place is called south carolina i mean it's like an hour and some minutes drive from where i live and here is how this place looks like Look at all these gorgeous houses. I'm going to be showing you some other gorgeous houses. Like, there are other places like the Landings, South Bridge, uh, so, uh, South Stone. I mean, it's, it's a very beautiful place. I just want to show you guys this place and I'm sure you will love it. Just for, for a good view, you know. Okay. So guys, look at how beautiful these houses are looking. This is, I mean, this is so beautiful. Look at this one here. I don't even know if this is a church or a house. But just for you to see how beautiful this area is. I'm going to be showing you things like this. I mean, it's so, it's so cool out here, ain't it? It's so lovely. This is so beautiful. Like, oh my goodness. Beautiful, beautiful structures. Like, oh my goodness. I don't know. I think this is their clubhouse. Because they used to have a clubhouse where everybody would come together and they would have fun. They would drink, they would eat, you know, do barbecue chicken and all that it's so beautiful it's just beautiful guys i said i was going to show you guys and here we go this is so lovely look at this pink house i love 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 this pink house it's so beautiful out here hello how are you doing it's so beautiful like i mean this is so beautiful oh my god guys look at this oh my goodness this is so cute oh my goodness this is beautiful i just love it it's so beautiful guys beautiful houses beautiful environment you know sometimes you know, you just want to go around and see places, you know, look at all those beautiful houses. I'm going to show you the road now. Let's sleep. Look at all these beautiful houses, guys. Hello, Hi. how are you doing? <laughs> These places are just too beautiful, guys. I just hope I don't hit somebody. <laughs> just, to, just to show you guys something, guys. This is just lovely. It's lovely. 
Isn't this beautiful, guys? Isn't this awesome? Do you know from here they can travel to anywhere with these boats? They can travel to anywhere they want to travel to look at. I mean, this is awesome, man. It's, it's awesome. Like, this is beautiful. This is the most beautiful thing. For real. Wow. Guys, look at this. They can travel from here to any part of the world. Look at, at the convenience of their house. Isn't this beautiful? This is lovely. Oh. How are you doing? It's not mine. Yeah, I know, I but it might be yours. what about yours? You want to tell me something about, about this place? It's so beautiful. Oh, where are you from? I'm from Nigeria. Oh, oh yeah. Never been there. I've never been here. I just came here and everything is beautiful here. Oh, okay. And, you know, I just want to, you know, adventure. I love it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I love it. I love to go to places. I love to travel to some areas to see how everywhere looks like. Okay. And then share with people, tell them. Oh, I mean, you have to be here to see the beauty of, you know, the beauty of the world. Everywhere is beautiful here. Well, you're not so bad yourself. Thank you, darling. Wow. So tell me, uh, where what do we call this place? Uh, Windmill Harbor. Wow. And it's uh, you're in South Carolina. South Carolina. Hilton Head. Hilton Head. And uh, it used to be a real island without a bridge in 1950, I think. Wow. And uh, way back when, in the 1930s, mm -hmm. I know there was a fellow by the name of. Albert Lee Lewis, mm -hmm. who was born in New York City. Wow. And uh, lived in a place called Tuxedo Park. Mm -hmm. And he he was instrumental in 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 the 30s and 40s in building, uh, creating sonar. That, you know the yeah sonar. And he was he was a uh, financier, amateur, mm -hmm. and he owned the island. Wow. They used to come down and hunt. You know, you know, there were inhabitants that owned their property, but I think it was about 17,000 square acres. And, wow. And he and his partner owned it and came down here to hunt and fish and... Wow. Whatever, whatever. So, this is beautiful. So it's a nice place. It's, it's a nice place. It's a beautiful place. Yeah, yeah. I thank you so much. What's yeah. the name? Tom. I'm Ann. And? My pleasure. Nice to meet you. Nice meeting you. Where's Thank your you. Next stop? Thank you so much. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna go that way right now. No, but I mean we're I'm going to Savannah now. Oh, and then yeah. How long are you in the I came up for? it's about one hour. Yeah, no, but I mean how long? How between here and when you go home again? You're going home to the Yeah, I'm gonna go home but not yet. Hello, how you doing? How you all doing? I'm gonna be going home not yet until I'm done with what I came to do here. Just here or No, not just here. I'm going to go around. Around the world. Not in 80 days. <laughs> right? Thank you so much, yeah. Mr. Robert. Bless your heart. Yeah, thank in you. In sense, not that. Thank you. We have a nasty South Carolina. South Carolina. <laughs> thank you. Have a safe trip. You too. Good <laughs> meeting you. You too. They have lovely homes here. Look at all these gorgeous guys. This is awesome. Hello. How are you all doing today? Frog here. Good. <laughs> this is beautiful. It's beautiful out here, guys. I love beautiful things. Don't blame me. <laughs> oh, look at this house. Look at this gorgeous. Oh, you guys just enjoy it, okay? I'll be showing you a couple of things around here. You guys, look at this house. See how beautiful. See how beautiful. This is awesome. So we are going to be driving home now. I'll just show you how this road is. Not when there's a lot of people running. Boom, boom, boom. People run like crazy here, guys. For real. Like the way people drive here in America. 
you will marvel. They don't have patience. They do not have patience at all. So you just want to be careful when you're driving. Otherwise, you're going to just crash. So I try to, you know, I try to be careful. Look at how they beautify everywhere. Man, America is beautiful. Guys, America is is so beautiful, guys. Look at, look at, oh my God. Guys, I gotta just stop. I need to stop at this point. Look at this, no patience. Did you see how they are running? No patience from the both sides. It can be very crazy here, guys, very crazy. So we have some traffic here. I'm gonna be moving on. I'll show you traffic still, guys. I'm going to end this vlog here guys I need to go and start walking I can't take you in I should have taken you in but I can't take you in otherwise I'll be sued yeah there are things you can't do here people think uh, America is a free land no it's not a free land they say it's a free place but it's not really if you do certain things you get sued one time so guys I just feel I should take you guys as I'm going to work yes I'll be doing this I don't know if it's going to be every time now, but I'll be doing this as I have the time. Because sometimes I'm running, I can't even do this. But today is just a little flexible. And I said, let me show you guys what a day in my life is going to work as a mom, a wife living in America. It's not easy, guys. You got to come back, do your house chores. Sometimes I have to do some house chores before I go to work. Sometimes I have to cook before I go to work. So that Sometimes I have to cook before I go to work. So that when my husband comes back, he has something to eat. When the girls comes back, they have something to eat. So guys, this is what we go through living in America. Some people don't know what we go through. When people back home are insisting, oh... You gave me so so amount. You gave me that amount. They don't know what we go through. Look at me driving from here to where I work. Like this is like two hours and something. Two, two and a half hours going and coming. Some places are even more far away. Sometimes I go to some places. It's two hours going, two hours coming. So you can imagine what that person is going through to make one dollar. And then when the person sends it to you in Nigeria... You just think it's easy to come by. It's not easy to come by, you know. But God is going to help each and every one of us. Anywhere you are, all I'm going to say is just work hard. Anywhere you are, just work hard, work smart. When I mean work hard, I mean work hard to make your money. If there's any other simple way you can make your money, okay, good for you. But where we are... You have to work hard be before you can be able to pay your bills. If you don't work like two jobs, three jobs sometimes, you can meet up with some things. So, I don't know how some people are making it, but God will help us to make it like the way God wants us to make it. I don't envy anybody. I don't care where you are. I don't envy anybody. Don't, don't, ever, in your, don't ever in your dream envy anybody because everybody will not tell you what their schedules are. If people tell you what their schedules are, you're going to be looking at your own schedule and you will say, thank you, Jesus. For me, I just thank God every day of my life, every minute, every second. I just thank him for everything. Because without him, I can do nothing. He's my source. I don't know about you. So, guys, I hope you have found this video interesting. Anywhere you are, I'm just going to advise you to work hard and believe God, even as you're working, that God will make your effort bear fruit. Because no matter how hard you even work, no matter how light you work, if the hand of God is not upon it, you will just be walking like an elephant and be eating like an ant. But I don't pray that this will be our portion. To never be our portion in the name of Jesus. Just know that anywhere you are, 
just sit up, tidy up yourself and do something to support yourself, to support your family and to support others in your own little way. And God will honor you. I hope you have learned one or two things from today. You saw how beautiful that boat side looks. I know people travel from that place to several places. It's a very beautiful place. I just wanted to show you guys what that environment looks like. Yeah, see people can travel from the comfort of their Jacksonville, Florida, how, um, you know, name it. You know, people travel from that place to anywhere they want to go to. They like to go for vacation. So all they do is get into their boats with their family, with everything they need to eat, travel for vacation, enjoy themselves, come back. They have planned their lives already. It's not going to be like Nigeria where, you know, people just suffer for nothing. Walk, 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 walk. You don't get your gratuite. Here you walk, you get your gratuite. They call it, um, what do they even, social security. When it's time for you to to relax, when it's time for you to relax and say you don't want to work anymore, your social, your social security will be paid for you. And that's what a lot of them are eating. Pension, that's what a lot of them are enjoying at the later end of their lives, you know. So if you plan your life well anywhere you are, actually, you will always eat in every evening of your life, you know. I hope we learn one or two things here. I hope to have a sit down video where we can really talk about some things maybe my experiences maybe things that are going on here in america so that some people back home can really know that that place you're running to well you have to get ready <laughs> to keep up with the schedule of that place because you can still be in nigeria and god will help you some people have traveled to places and it doesn't work for them they feel like, oh, why did I come here? I want to go back home. But I just believe you can find a way around anywhere you are. And with the help of God, you're still going to make it no matter how. God bless you and stay for more videos like this. I hope you give me a massive thumbs up. Good to see you. Be loving, be kind, be merciful. God love the merciful heart. I'll see you when I see you. My face looks so tired. Yes, because I keep working. Because I got to pay bills. I love you all. Ciao, ciao. <laughs>